boys and girls, I'm Jean Marie Bond and I am so happy to be here with you today. Today, we've got a really special lesson plan and it's all about fruit. Do you like fruit? I love fruit. I think one of my favorite fruits is an apple. I grew up in Washington State and that is the apple capital of the world. I also like pears. That's another beautiful fall fruit. Of course, there's always a banana. There's nothing better than a banana. And of course, in the winter, we love our oranges that we get to peel. I also love green grapes. They're so sweet and delicious. And while you don't really eat this, a lemon is also a fruit. But I think one of my very favorite fruits is a kiwi fruit. Isn't that funny? It's got green inside, but it's all brown and bumpy on the outside. You know, we're going to talk a little bit about fruit that God talks about in the Bible, and that's called the fruits of the Spirit. The fruits of the Spirit are love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. These are fruits that God gives us when we live in his word and when we live in his life. Let's talk a little bit about each one of them. Love. Well, love is that feeling when your mom and your dad tuck you into bed at night and they say, I love you. And you just know you're so warm and snuggly in your bed. And you just know that your parents love you more than anything. And that's how God loves us. God loves us, he loves our parents, and he loves us even more than anyone could ever imagine. Then there's joy. Joy is like during COVID when all the playgrounds were shut down and we couldn't go play on them, but all of a sudden they opened up and we could go and we could swing on the swings and we could climb on the monkey bars and we were so joyful that we got to do that. Peace. They talk about world peace, and that's one kind of peace, but there's also peace that comes from it within, and that is the peace that God gives us. He gives us peace when we realize that he loves us, and we are in him, and he is us. And then, of course, there's patience. Oh, patience. That's a hard one. Patience is like when you really, really, really want to get through with your homework, and you want to get all your coloring done, because you just want to go outside and play. But you have to be patient because you know you have those math problems to do and you know that you have those spelling words. So patience is something that God gives us when we ask him for it. There's also kindness. Kindness is what I know all of you are. You're kind to your friends. You're kind to your grandparents. You're kind to your animals and your pets. You're kind to your parents. That's another fruit that lives within us because of God. And then, of course, there's goodness. Goodness is when we just do something as a just pure joy of our heart, of trying to be kind and good to somebody else. Goodness is when we follow the rules. Goodness is when we show up in school and we do what the teacher tells us to do. Goodness is when mom and dad tell us it's time to go to bed. We don't fuss. We just say, you know, Mom and Dad, I guess I am tired. I'm going to be good, and I'm going to go to bed right now. Then there's faithfulness. We talk about faith in church all the time. Having faith is believing. Faithfulness is also being true as a friend. Faithfulness is making sure that you keep your word with other people. Faithfulness is always being a friend to somebody. Faithfulness is always telling the truth so people know that you can be faithful for what you say. And of course, then there's gentleness. Gentleness is like holding a little baby and rocking it to sleep. You coo and you have to be so gentle with the baby. And that's another gift of the fruit of the Spirit that God gives us. And finally, there's self-control. I know you know what self-control is. Self-control is when you're really mad or you're really angry and you really want to yell, but you realize that would not be a fair thing for me to do. Even though I'm mad and even though I'm angry, I need to control myself and be kind 
and good and patient and peaceful and joyful and loving and gentle with everyone around me. So the fruits of the Spirit God gives us when we live in God and we live in Jesus, God gives us these wonderful gifts, just like God grew the apples and the orange trees to give us those fruits. And so as you go about your week, I'd like you to think about how can God help me be more loving? How can God help me be more joyful? How can God help me to have more peace? in my life and in my family? How can God help me to be more patient when I really want to get through my homework? How can Jesus help me to be kind just like he was to the little children? How can Jesus help me to be good and just always think kind things and do good things for other? How can Jesus help me be faithful, always saying my prayers at night before I go to bed, always being truthful and honest. How can God and Jesus help me be gentle, be soft and caring? And finally, how can God and Jesus help me to control myself when I'm feeling a little bit of anger? Right now, it's been so much fun having this time with you. And what I would like you to do with me is what Miss Jenny tells us to do. I want you to grab a little piece of heaven and I want you to pull it straight down to your heart. And then I want you to bow your head and close your eyes and pray with me. Our Lord Jesus, our Heavenly Father, we are so grateful and thankful for the fruits that you give us. Not only the delicious fruits, that we get to eat every day, but the special fruits of the Spirit, of the Spirit dwelling in us, those fruits that give us patience and help us to be kind and help us to be loving and make us joyful. We are so thankful for these gifts because we know they give you give them to us because we are your special people. We love you, God. We thank you for this new week ahead of us. And please help us always to be mindful of your fruits. Amen. Bye guys. Good news. Good news. Good news. Good news. Of great joy. Of great joy. Of great joy. Of great joy. For all people. I'm here to For all people. Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Now let's get to work.